funeral services in Gaza for militants and civilians killed in Israeli airstrikes. And the barrage of Hamas rockets sends terrified Israelis looking for cover. The people of Israel can't long tolerate this kind of uh, situation where our cities are under constant rocket attacks. Uh, I prefer a diplomatic solution. I hope that we can get one. Uh, but if not, we have every right to defend ourselves with other means. And we shall use them. Egypt's president says the end of Israel's nearly week-long offensive may be imminent. That as diplomats from across the world race to negotiate a ceasefire. I'm here to appeal personally for an end to the violence and to offer my help to offer my help in ongoing efforts to achieve a ceasefire. President Barack Obama has dispatched Secretary of State Hillary Clinton for meetings with Israel's Prime Minister, the Palestinian President and Egyptian leaders, with tens of thousands of Israeli soldiers awaiting a possible order to invade the Gaza Strip. Talks are all the more urgent. Both Israel and Hamas are bringing a list of demands to the negotiating table. Hamas wants Israel to end all of its attacks and lift tight restrictions on trade and travel to and from the Gaza Strip. Israel is calling for an end to rocket fire from Gaza. It also wants international guarantees that Hamas won't use Egypt's Sinai region, which sits between Gaza and southern Israel, to attack Israelis. Bianca Davy, Associated Press.